All right, guys. Uh, I finally decided to start removing the the springs and valves, but I ran into problem where I didn't have a tool for it to remove it. I did have this, which they say it removes it. I bought it online, and uh, it doesn't work. Uh, then I had uh, another one which is something like this it does not work don't buy this stuff it doesn't work so uh, what I ended up doing is uh, making my own as you can see I already removed four of them this is just a stand and this is a uh, a pretty much a, a tool that I compress the spring press it with this long thing I welded it I made it I mean I drilled a couple of holes to adjust it uh, it's a uh, it's bolted on on the table I can always unscrew it and uh, yeah I will uh, I will see if I can show you how how it works it's a, it's a really if you have a, a, a little bit of a spare uh, of piping and, and, and hoses I mean a spare metal you can make this uh, this bottom part you can make by uh, I would say uh, put in a washers me I used it I, I actually used it from this tool that I bought I used the tip of it so now it's as you can see it's welded right there and then yeah it, that's how I do it but anyway I will show you how to how to remove one real quick and just so you can see that it actually works all right let's get all right guys as you can see uh, you just line that tool I mean tip of it inside there align the head and you just press it as you can see it popped out get your uh, metal or whatever you're using to take this out most of the people use metal to take these uh, I mean magnet uh, you can see that I got both of them right there and as you can see the, the, the spring is is out right there uh, I would say uh, it took me probably around uh, 45 minutes to make this tool and uh, I checked online there's similar things that are like uh, like $45 and I figured you know what just let me make something similar to it because uh, yeah it, it's 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 simple it's it's easy I mean I'm pretty sure the install would probably be the same uh, so yeah guys uh, this this video just shows that everybody can do it just with a little bit of a skill in the welding I mean not much but a little bit or you can even uh, take it to your machine shop and somebody can weld it for you I mean it's it's not that it's not that big deal so yeah it's 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 simple it's easy uh, I use my spare pipes and all that to, to make it so yeah and here she is it's all uh, stripped down I'm getting ready to start uh, sanding all this area first and I'm gonna start uh, painting uh, the, the door trims and the uh, uh, fender things inside the uh, what's it called the uh, engine uh, back bumper and all that on the back right here I'm gonna paint that first so yeah uh, everything is pretty much getting ready I'm just uh, kind of running out of money and uh, time mostly time it's just busy busy with work so yeah that's that's how you uh, remove uh, a valve uh, springs as you can see you can move this uh, 
left and right and once you find the, the thing you can always always make sure you put the the head is not moving that much put something like a rag or something and then you just as you can see you just apply tension and the whole thing just pops in there I might do some uh, tweaking over here I might might do something differently I might do this where this start rocking left and right so I might drill a hole here and then fold it yeah I might redo some things but yeah this works just fine anyway that that's how I uh, remove my uh, the springs for the valves uh, hopefully you guys uh, learned something today and uh, yeah make sure you like it subscribe and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time in the next video. Laters.